वेलकम टू इट्स टुबारो न्यूज आई एम हेना तलाटी विंड्स हिट एटी माइल्स पर आर इन वेल्स डेंजरस बिल्डिंग इंसिडेंट्स इन आयरलैंड आफ्टर स्टॉम एग्नेस स्टॉम एग्नेस हैज मेड लैंडफॉल विद एटी माइल्स पर आर गर्स डाउनिंग पावर लाइंस एंड कॉजिंग फ्लडिंग ट्रीज हैव बीन टॉपल्ड एंड इन वन इरेश टाउन a roof was ripped from the building but the forecasters have warned the worst is still to come with weather warnings in place across much of the united kingdom winds battering the north of the country are potentially very dangerous said the chief north of the england correspondent the local lifeboat station has closed as gusts are expected to hit 850 miles per hour he said and there are several hours more disruption expected in the united kingdom there was a sense really that the intensification of the storm before it hit ireland meant that it had lost some of its power by the time it made its way across wales and now across england as well but certainly these winds are strong and potentially damaging and potentially very dangerous to anyone in their path earlier it was reported how 80 miles per hour gust had been recorded at a mountain village in wales hitting the top end of forecasters predictions gales at keppel creek have not settled there producing the gust of 84 miles per hour between 8 pm and 9 pm this surpasses yesterday's warnings from the met office which expected 65 to 75 miles per hour in the worst heat areas of the united kingdom and possibly highs of 80 miles per hour a rescue crew towed a yacht for 22 miles through the gale force winds and 4 meter swells after its engine lost power of the coast of the island a lone sailor was stranded 10 miles from the clare island as weather conditions deteriorated this morning the northern island fire and rescue service found a car in the river moyola in the depest town with the drive trapped inside storm agnes is the first named storm of the season it arrived in the northern island around lunch time and has caused disruption to some flights some ferries and to power lines almost 300 customers across the northern island including points pass in the county armagh are still without power due to the severe weather The Met Office and the Met Airm had both issued weather warnings and had advised of the possibility of the disruption to travel. The NIFRS attended the scene of the trapped vehicles at about 14:30 BST on Wednesday. The conditions changed very quickly, and the firefighter on the roof of the car had to take decisive action to save the occupant. The firefighter broke the rear window and brought the driver out of the car and onto the roof. In the Republic of Ireland, strong winds toppled several trees in the Cork and Dublin. In the coastal town of Youghal, County Cork, part of the roof was blown off a building on Front Strand. Cork Council confirmed the road was closed and the situation was being monitored by the Gardaí and the fire services. A status yellow warning for rain is in place for Cork, Carlow, Dublin, Kilkenny, Wexford, Wicklow-Kerry and Waterford until midnight with the yellow warning for the wind covering Leinster, Munster and Galway during the same period. There has been some localized flooding in the Cork and Cork County Council has warned motorists to avoid driving through the flooded waters. That's all for now for more news updates stay tuned with us. It's tomorrow news. For more global weather updates like this subscribe our channel and hit the bell icon for regular updates.